Hey guys, make 5 one and we're back with more Let's Play Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. In the last part, we beat up Koyume and Katake as they shot their fire... No, they shot their fire and ice at us, like Pat Benatar did. Um, so anyway, we're gonna just um, go through the portal and see who the Sage of Spirit is. I guess Spirit Sage would make more sense than saying Sage of Spirit. Alright. Excuse me. If you heard that. Oh, big shocker there. It's Naboru. Kid, let me thank you. Hee hee hee. Look what the little kid has become in the past seven years. A, comp a competent swordsman. I thought that said a complete swordsman. By the way, I really messed up. I was brainwashed by those old witches and used by Ganondorf to do his evil will. But that is, isn't that funny? That a person like me could turn out to be the Sage of Spirit. And now, I'm going to fight them as one of the six sages. <laughs> I'm going to pay them back for what they did to me. Snap. Kid? No. Wink. The Hero of Time. Instead of keeping the promise I made back then, I give you this medallion. Take it. You didn't make a promise. We made a promise. That if we found the Silver Gauntlets, we'd give them to you. But considering we need the Silver Gauntlets... Why don't you just give, your, give us your medallion that doesn't add any power to us at all? Alright. You can see the shadow medallion. Spirit medallion. Yada yada yada. Power. It doesn't do anything though. If only I knew you would become such a handsome man. He's handsome. He's blonde. I should have kept the promise I made back then. You didn't make a promise, Naboru. We did. All right, so. Link, the hero. Finally, all of us, the six sages, have been awakened. The time for the final showdown with the king of evil has come. Before that, though, you should meet the one who is waiting for you. The one who is waiting for you at the temple of time. There's someone waiting for us at the temple of time? I wonder who that could be. But we're not going to go there yet. Yes, we are. I lied. Alright. I was going to say, if we had 50 Skulltulas, we can go pick up a heart piece, but we don't have 50 Skulltulas, so... Where does that leave me? Alright. I guess I can go pick up another Skulltula. And then... I have been waiting for you, Link. We warped, but we apparently ran in. Sheik. Link, the hero of time. You have overcome many hardships and awakened six sages. And now you have a final challenge. A showdown with Ganondorf, the king of evil. Before that, I have things I want to tell only to you. Please listen. Another unknown legend of the Triforce passed down by the Shadow Folk, the Sheikah. Oh, another one? You jerk face. Alright. If you would seek the sacred triangle, listen well. The resting place of the sacred triangle, the sacred realm, is a mirror that reflects which what is in the heart. The heart of one who enters it. If an evil heart, the realm will become full of evil. If pure, the realm will become a paradise. Triforce, the sacred triangle. It is a balance that weighs the three forces, power, wisdom, and courage. If the heart of the one who holds the sacred triangle has all three forces in balance, that one will gain the true force to govern all. Hmm. Awesome. But if that one's heart is not in balance, the Triforce will soon separate into three parts, power, wisdom, and courage. Only one part will remain for the one who touched the Triforce, the part representing the force that, will mo that one most believes in. If that one looks the true for that, that one seeks the true force, that one must acquire the two lost parts. Those two parts will be held within others chosen by destiny, 
who will bear the Triforce mark on the backs of their hands. It's actually on the back of their left hand, but whatever. I'm not complaining. Seven years ago, Ganondorf, the King of Thieves, used the door you opened in the Temple of Time and entered the Sacred Realm. But when he laid his hands on the Triforce, the legend came true. The Triforce separated into three parts, only the Triforce of Power remained in Ganondorf's hand. It's actually the top of the Triforce. The strength of the Triforce of Power enabled him to become a mighty evil king, but his dark ambitions were not satisfied. To gain complete mastery of the world, Ganondorf started looking for those chosen by destiny to hold the other two Triforce parts. The other, the one who holds the Triforce of Courage is you, Link. And the other who holds the Triforce of Wisdom is the seventh sage who is destined to be the leader of them all. <laughs> you? Um, yeah. Link has the bottom right part of the triangle, and... Um, Sheik, did you just become a woman? Hello. It is I, the Princess of Hyrule, Zelda. I think Sheik just became a woman. I apologize for meeting you in disguise, but it was necessary to hide from the King of Evil. Please forgive me. On that day, seven years ago, Ganondorf attacked Hyrule Castle. I saw you as you were as I was escaping from the castle with my attendant, Impa. Oh, it's in black and white. It's kind of cool. I thought I should entrust the ocarina to you. I thought that you would be our best chance. Well, you made a right decision, buddy. Girl. Girlfriend. Alright, where'd the spiritual stones go? As long as you had the ocarina in your possession. I thought Ganondorf could never enter the sacred realm, but... Something I could never expect happened. I became a man. After you opened the door of time... It's not capitalized, nor is it blue. The Master Sword sealed you away in the Sacred Realm. Your spirit remained in the Sacred Realm, and then the Triforce fell into Ganondorf's hands. He went on to invade the Sacred Realm. Well, if your spirit's in the Sacred Realm, where's your body? Just laying down? Ganondorf had become the Evil King, and the Sacred Realm became a world of evil. All of this is unfortunate coincidence. I passed myself off as a Sheikah and hoped that you would return. I waited for seven years. And now you are back. The Dark Age ruled by Ganondorf, the Evil King, will end. The Six Ages will open the sealed door and lure Ganondorf back into the Sacred Realm. I will then seal the door to the Sacred Realm from this world. Thus, Ganondorf, the Evil King, will vanish from Hyrule. Link, in order to do this, I need your courage again. Please protect me while I do my part. And here is a weapon that can penetrate the Evil King's what? Oh, his defenses. The power given to the Chosen Ones. The Sacred Arrow of Light. Now this is the final um, arrow upgrade that you will get, unless, of course, you haven't gotten the um, Ice Arrows. And it's an arrow in frozen lemonade. Cool. I love frozen lemonade. You got the white arrow, said it's a C, and your arrows will be powered up. The light of justice will smite evil. Okay. Okay. What's happening? My controller is vibrating. I'm scared. That rumbling. It can't be. Oh, good. You've turned Zelda into money. Now she's worth 50 rupees. Princess Zelda, you foolish traitor! I command, I commend you for avoiding my pursuit for seven long years. But you won't let your guard down. I knew you would appear if I let this kid wander around. That's kind of weird. My only mistake was to slightly underestimate the power of this kid. Aw, who knew money can fly? 
No, it was not the kid's power I misjudged. It was the power of the trifles of courage. But with that trifles of wisdom that Zelda has, I obtain these two triforces, that I will become the true ruler of the world. If you want to rescue Zelda, come to my castle. Hmm. Okay. I kind of want to rescue Zelda, so you know what? I'll go to your castle. But we will have to wait till the next part. So next time on Legend of Zelda: Ocarina of Time, we will be going to Ganondorf's castle. Uh, thanks for watching, and goodbye.